bipole results have turned up some really big stunners. The BJP has won the Rampur Uttar Pradesh seat. The BJP's Akash Saxena has defeated Asim Raja in the Rampur bipole. After trailing behind in initial rounds, the BJP's Akash Saxena has defeated the Samajwadi Party's Asim Raja by over 33,700 votes in the Rampur bipole. Rampur, remember, is Samajwadi Party Neta Azam Khan's bastion. That's his gud. And remember earlier today, the Samajwadi Party's Asim Raja had alleged electoral fraud in Rampur, saying that the booths were captured. He said that the booths had been taken over and that 2.25 lakh people were stopped from polling. So amidst an ill-tempered battle between the Samajwadi Party and the BJP, the BJP has managed to win in Rampur. So let's take a quick look at the numbers once again. Rampur is the very important Samajwadi Party bastion of Azam Khan who was disqualified, necessitating this particular bipole. And now the BJP has taken that seat in what is turning out to be an extremely embarrassing turn of events for the Samajwadi Party. This is the Lok Sabha seat. Let's go across to India today's Rahul Gautam for more. He joins us live from Rampur. Uh, Rahul, take us through how this happened. You know, how are the two parties looking at this? The Samajwadi Party already, you know, claiming poll rigging, booth capturing and things like that. But it looks like Asim Raja has lost by a huge margin. Absolutely, you know. Uh, you know, and this is considered to be the biggest margin, uh, you know, that Rampur has ever seen in last 40 years. For four decades, Rampur has been voting for Azam Khan and his family. But this time around, BJP has breached this fortress of Samajwadi Party because they have won this seat with the... Uh, with a big margin of almost 33,000 votes. Now, I myself spoke with Akash Saxena and he said that both Hindus and Muslims voted for BJP and in fact he also rejected all the allegations. You can see behind me, this is Akash Saxena's vehicle which is now being uh, taken to his residence and obviously he's speaking with the media persons here. Uh, the BJP uh, is making this victory big given the fact that for 40 years this seat has been with uh, Azam Khan and his family. The BJP is saying that uh, uh, because people were actually upset and disappointed with kind of negative politics that Azam Khan has been playing from this stuff, that's why they had booted him out and, and that's why they have voted for the BJP. I also must tell you that when uh, counting uh, you know, began this morning around 8 a.m. at that point of time, for almost 20 rounds, Samajwadi Party was leading. However, the margin was not very big. But after, uh, yes. you know, 20th round, the BJP started gaining up. And uh, by the time, it, uh, the, you know, it was around uh, 2, 2 p.m., okay. the BJP had managed to uh, gain a margin of over 30,000. So it's a big victory because Azam Khan, remember, his legacy looms large yes. over, uh, Ra uh, you know, Rampur. And it seems that BJP has breached this uh, important citadel of Samajwadi Party this time around. This is a big one. Remember the 2014 election? Uh, yeah, the, the Lok Sabha election at that time, it was a BJP, uh, you know, BJP uh, candidate that had won the Lok Sabha seat from Rampur. Now you've got a BJP candidate, Akash Saxena, defeating the Samajwadi Party's Asim Raja in the same Samajwadi Party bastion of Rampur that in many ways is associated directly with Azam Khan. He was disqualified after those cases against him and now... It belongs to the BJP. Big, big symbolic victory for the BJP against Akhilesh's Samajwadi Party.